Welcome to another news of a bizarre quippets and this article is from the Miami Herald an exploding wedding dress a placenta of who done it deafening farts that got a security guard fired absurd laughable and eyebrow raising news stories were everywhere in 2018 Florida alone provided enough zaniness to amuse the entire country, but with so many oddities to read about or scoff about or laugh about, some stories were forgotten or overshadowed, so before embarking on another year that promises to be equally weird, here's a roundup of some of the most deliciously bizarre stories from the last 12 months. These stories were written by McClatchy reporters across the United States. Family and friends advised a Texas woman to donate her wedding dress when her marriage ended. Instead, she rigged it with explosives and shot at it, unleashing an explosive end of marriage ablaze. It was liberating pulling that trigger. It was closure for all of us. He was hunting wild mushrooms. Instead, he found a rare, inexplicable two-headed deer. A Minnesota man scouring a forest for wild mushrooms stumbled upon an amazing, extremely rare two-headed fawn which had been stillborn. Researchers did a battery test on the deer to better understand the rare deformity. Not your typical graduation picture. A Texas AM student wrote on Facebook as she posted photos celebrating the end of the college. That might be the understatement of 2018. She's standing in a knee deep of water next to a thousand pound alligator named Big Tex. A Canadian woman left her bloody placenta as well as forceps and medical wrap lying on the ground in a park so it would become part of nature. But a dog discovered the mysterious afterbirth triggering chaos and search because police worried someone was in medical distress. I was honestly really moved, the woman reportedly said. I've never had so many people worried about me coming forth for me. I was actually brought to tears. A Florida hospital security guard made a name for himself and amassed a huge following on Instagram by posting videos of himself releasing thunderous farts at work that his employer found the clips. Marijuana smoked lobster's main restaurant to get crustaceans stoned before cooking. Maine legalized recreational weed early this year and one restaurant is taking advantage of it in a surprising way. It's getting lobsters stoned before they're cooked alive. Her best friend was mysteriously killed. This selfie held the clue police needed. After a Canadian woman was strangled and left dead near a Saskatoon landfill, investigators were unsure who killed her, but a selfie her best friend friend posted of the two on Facebook unraveled the mystery. How many plumbers does it take to fix an airplane toilet? Despite having 85 plumbers on board, a Norwegian flight bound for Germany had to turn around because of a busted, unfixable toilet. Marching crawfish invade a South Carolina yard after a tropical storm. Oh my gosh, they were everywhere. Tropical storm Michael tore down power lines, brought punishing winds to South Carolina in October. For one family, it brought something weirder, an infestation of swarming crawfish, which threatened to take over their garage. Okay, the samples at Costco were free. Two men in their 70s got into a fight over them, South Carolina please say. Police said it started when a 72-year-old budged in front of a 70-year-old in a line for cheese samples at a Costco in Greenville, South Carolina, but it was at the line for complimentary cheeseburgers that the younger man dared the line cutter to do it again and they got hit by the line cutter, according to police. A mysterious square aircraft hovering in the night sky scared me to death, North Carolina man says. This North Carolina man said he didn't believe in a UFO until he was driving and spotted something in the sky that he said scared me to death. He took pictures of it then pulled over and tried to record video, but the UFO disappeared, he said. Everyone has coping mechanisms for cold weather, but true to form alligators cold weather rituals might be the creepiest of all as videos from a frozen North Carolina swamp shows. A North Carolina swamp park has posted a video explaining how alligators survive in a frozen pond and it's both creepy and bizarre. The cold-blooded devils essentially allow themselves to be frozen in place with their noses just above the surface. And those are a few of some of the crazy stories this year. And you guys have a great day and thank you for being weird and bizarre so we can feature you here this year on the News of the Bizarre. Right here on the Coconut Daddy channel, you can subscribe, share, and like. You guys 
have a wonderful 2019. Who's your daddy?